We now have 23 players in the Super Eagles of Nigeria camp. Right behind me, they are currently having their final training session. I'm right here with AJ to do a quick match preview and also show you the training session. Nigeria takes on Libya on Friday, the 11th of October, here at the Ghost of International Stadium in Uyo. At the stance right now in the group, Nigeria currently topped the group with four points and will face Libya over two legs this month. Only the top two teams in this group qualify to the 2025 African competitions in Morocco next year. What are your thoughts and expectations for the game against Libya on uh, Friday in Rio? Well, I think everybody knows the truth. Libya are another African team, but not that mighty of another African team. If you're talking about mighty teams, start with Tunisia, Egypt, Algeria, you know, Libya are not that huge. The Mediterranean Knights uh, are a side to reckon with, but I think the quality of the Super Eagles always will blow them away. If um, to think about what's going to happen tomorrow, I think Nigeria obviously have domination and you know, possession. It all boils down to what they can do with that possession and that scoring goals. And if I'm to make an early prediction, I think Nigeria should win by at least two goals to nil. You know, we've got two injuries, major injuries, and that's not here, Simon's not here as well. And that means uh, uh, Osaitan will return to uh, Ejike. So I'm looking at Mwabeli starting back four of. Uh, um, back four, you know, it might be back three, but let's say back four. Uh, Calvin Bassi, Semi Ajayi, William Trostekong, and uh, Ola Aina. Midfield, Ndidi, uh, I want to say Ndidi, and uh, Iwobi, and Onyeka. That's a, that's a midfield three I want. Mm -hmm. And then front three would be, for me, Ihana Cho, starting with uh, Simon Moses and Adema Lukman. That's my formation, and I hope that it happens tomorrow. Prediction for this game and prediction for the game against Libya away from home? Uh, I think, like I said earlier, two goals to nil here. But I don't know if you understand what Libya are trying to do. They're trying to get into Nigeria's heads by changing stadium, you know, I'm already making it that like they're planning to revenge and enjoy, even if they've not seen what happens in the first leg, uh, the first game. So I think if we have a draw, that'd be nice. I'm going for a 1-1 one -one draw in Libya. Yeah, you can follow AJ, uh, X, Facebook, yeah, uh, X Instagram, 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 Football, and X, and then Facebook, MP for Transfer Market. Alright, thanks for watching. Don't forget to drop a like and follow me here. And as always, have a good day, guys.